what is up guys, it's Mike it's Memo here, and welcome to my YouTube channel, and most of all, welcome to my Gothic 3 playthrough, the playthrough of the Servant of Beliard, Hashishin Dark Mage, and in this episode, we're gonna meet, and greet, and kill, Khan, and his uh, remaining Orc Patrol parties. Why? Because we can, I need some levels. The more, the better. Oh, and we're gonna learn regeneration. Finally. We're getting closer and closer to finally beating this game once and for all. Aside from the hardcore run, should you guys vote? by smashing those like buttons. One video in each path of each game will count towards the hardcore run and thus is why you only need 100 because you know if every video would count then one person could get the hardcore run without you know too much trouble. So 100 likes for the hardcore run, but one path, one video, each individual game. There are about six games in total. You know, Gothic 1, Gothic 2, Gothic 3, Gothic 3 Forsaken Gods, Gothic 4, and Fall of Satyria. Now, I don't like those games, you know, especially Forsaken Gods, especially Gothic 4, and most definitely, you know, Fall of Satyria, but um, I'm still gonna do them. But they have three paths, you know, only 100 likes divided by three paths. If every video would count, it would have been child's play. So I gotta be a bit fair and square. Games with one path require one video with 25 likes in its playthrough. A game with multiple paths, it depends on how many paths a certain game has. Every time, you know, first, if the game has one run, and you want a hardcore run, which will be the second run, you know, you will need 25 likes. If you want a second run, but the game has a third run, let's say, you know, the game has two paths, but you want, you know, you want that second part as well, that's no problem, it will be uploaded instantly. Where the games have one path or three paths, they, their paths will eventually all be uploaded. However, you know, I can't, you know, really make it too easy for you guys to unlock the shit so depending on how many paths this current game has a certain amount of likes is required in order to get the hardcore run 25 likes with one run games to get the hardcore run which is the second run you know it's just saying games with two runs will require 50 for the hardcore run games with three paths will require 100 every time it gets doubled you know so from 100 to 2 from 2 to 4 from 4 to 8 etc so the more paths a game has the harder and the more likes it requires in order to unlock but because of the fact that it, that you know each individual game has multiple paths it makes it a bit easier to unlock it even though i ask a, lo a certain amount of likes for it, you know. Unless it gets too intense, but you know, Skyrim for example with 10 runs, the 11th run will be the hardcore run. Before I'm that far, we are 5 to 10 years ahead, I think. Because uh, getting Skyrim done and all 10 paths, each vanilla race with each, each own individual build, it's tricky, you know, especially if the game gets bugged, corrupted, or what have you, you know. But uh, let's just continue. Stop! Not one step further. Let me pass. You can go in. Oh, thank you. Got some bundles of weapons around here, sir. And Zubin went to the desert, and there he drove his staff into the ground and said, 
This is where I shall build my realm for you. And the faith of the orcs became the faith of the humans. Oh, so it's vice versa. Interesting. So the orcs... Ah, uh, well. You get my drift, yeah. Yeah, you know, a little quick, uh, quick, uh, quickity quick. The orcs worship Balear because of the fact they summoned the sleeper, you know. But because this guy killed the sleeper, Balear ascended the undead dragon, which made their faith a bit more powerful in Balear. I killed the undead dragon, and they still cling to Balear, you know. Now, she shouldn't do as well, but, uh,. These guys do not want the artifact to use up the power. No, they want the artifacts to give it to Sardis so he can destroy the artifacts. But um, let's talk with Great Khan, learn regeneration, and uh, get my reward the Orc Commander armor. And then I will see how many learning points I've left, see what I can train. Because I do need a bit of thieving capabilities to 100, which require me to spend about 60 learning points into it. For that alone, then I still have to learn these, this, 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 and this. But, uh, yeah. What's wrong, Mora? I have come to offer my services to you, Great Conqueror. I see. So you are the Mora of whom my general spoke to me. You are a strong warrior. And you deserve respect. Can you teach me something? Bah! Go see my instructors. I haven't got time for such things. What orders do you have for me, Great Conqueror? According to what they say, you are strong enough to rid us of the rebels once and for all. Take my personal guard and kill all rebel leaders in my country. Is that all? Not quite. I've been holding the fort in this castle for a long time. I am waiting for a chance to attack the capital, Vengard. But that damn barrier the king set up just won't allow it. But I'm sure there is a way to get into the king's castle. And that the rebels know of it. I see. I will break the resistance of humankind for good. If you manage to do that, I will richly reward you. Do you hear me? Yes, I hear you. Good. Then go forth and do my bidding. King Robar is dead. What are you telling me? Dead? <laughs> You're one amazing devil. How long have I been waiting for this news? All right. Then all that's left to do now is to eradicate the remaining rebel spawn. Go take care of that, and I will bestow on you the greatest honor that Amora has ever received from an orc. Hmm, sounds good. I eliminated all major rebel leaders. Did you really? And what about that joker in Sildin who interrupts our chain of supply from Nordmar? Ah, uh, yes. His camp must be up there in the woods, somewhere between Sildin and the pass that leads to Nordmar. Hmm, I seem to have forgotten about him. Then get moving! Go to Sildin and kill that mora! Totally forgot indeed. Well, Death he will be. For it is the will of Baliar. Did I kill the under underground rebel here? Yes, I did. Right, so let's kill Anog.
Go. Go back. No. Go. Folks. One filthy beast less. Right, so let's quickly deliver the good news. The escaped slaves are dead. Very good. And they can't cause any more trouble. Indeed. Anog, the leader of the rebels at the pass, is dead. That is good. Then it won't be long before the rest of the band surrenders. You have done the Orcish people a great service. Belia will reward you for this. How about if you reward me for it? Mm. What do you want? Glory? Honor? You already have too much for a mora. If you are interested in gold, you can have it. And now go! I am busy. Still need four bundles of weapons. Not a much though, but... Alright, so let's again teleport to Faring and talk with Gun.
Let's see if we can find some bundles of weapons around here. You are wanted here for theft. They are mere words, exactly. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't believe a word of it. You thieving little moron. Eventually, they will all submit. Stop right there, moron. You are wanted here for theft. Let's forget the whole thing. No. You thieving little Mora! When did I last quick save? Because I did not know that I was that far. Stop right there, Mora. The kingdom of humans has fallen for good. The king and the rebels have been eradicated. Ha ha ha. And all that was your work, Mora. You have earned the greatest distinction there is. This honor has never been bestowed on a Mora. Come and receive your reward. I bow my head before you, great warrior. What happens next? We will try to get rid of this accursed barrier around Vengar. I will raise your king's castle to the ground. Nothing shall be left of it. Never again shall the people of the Moras rise again. That will be my task. And you will set out on your own now that your people are defeated. May your battles be victorious, great warrior. Would you teach me how to fight? Show me how to heal myself. Then ignore the pain. That is the ancient art of the mind. And concentration is the key to self-healing. Bring your mind into harmony with your body. Concentrate on your breathing. Thus, your mind will rule your body. It will bring peace and healing. Do you know why we won the war? Because the Moras are weak. Bye bye. I will come for you, buggers, later. Faring is obviously the first city that will fall. I still got 23 learning points left. So let me quickly go to Trellis. I just picked one, you know, to get that out of that ASAP. Beliar. 
Grant me the highest knowledge of the ancient magic. Age left. Now who would be able to teach me Starfighting level 3? Aside from the mages that are already killed. I don't think many. But I can try one of the black mages. Or all of them basically. See it as a preparation to liberate Mertana from the orcs as well. sleep anymore. Wrong one. I don't know what I took back. His dominion will shut up, man. Teach we are the chosen people. Milton. Wealth for us, dominion for Beliar, and his dominion will come. And then those who have drawn his wrath shall tremble. Hopefully, Milton is now not an enemy because he can certainly teach me. Of your mind? How could you let the orcs have the fire chalices? Enos is angry. Now the holy fire will no longer aid us. Relax. Everything will be all right. It had better be. Teach me something about ancient magic. You don't know how to. Intriguing. Could be that only one of the water mages was able to teach that. If that is the case, you know, I doubt it, but or any other of the other fire mages that I currently killed, basically. Yeah. You know, that is the case then so shall it be, then I will not get staff level three. Because it's optional, you know, it's not a must, it's the mage part that wants the staff basically. Teach me. T 
teach me. Maybe the mage in Braga, but before I will kill the orcs though. I will first dedicate an whole episode to where is the guru? Because I'm by far not full build yet. guys for watching if you like what you see subscribe to my channel hit the like button I'm gonna google where I can uh, which trainers can you know learn staff comet level 3 just to see if there is anyone of that list which I still have alive if that is not the case then I know that I can focus on the last thing that I basically need, which is acrobatics, endurance of the wolf, resistance uh, to diseases, and all remaining thieving capabilities. And then we're maxed, and then we can finish the game. So, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I hope to see you guys next time. Ne next time. <laughs> and I hope to, you know, if you like what you see, subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button if you want to see a, a gothic series, not the gothic one, gothic 2, no. You vote instantly for the entire series, gothic series, hardcore run. Which means beating the game from the beginning to the end, as full build as possible, speed run style. Which means, you know, skipping conversations, uh, you know, and just go through the game as quickly as possible but with the twist that i'm gonna get full build in everything that is possible so the major difference in that regard starts at uh, gothic 3 because you know you can learn pretty much everything in uh, gothic 1 and gothic 2 if you do it right which of course will do but uh, that's for the future plans thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys next time